this is a set funnel, and what we can use this for is to uh, extract certain materials into an organic layer while it's in from an aqueous water layer. And so what's important about the two of these is that you have to use a, two solvent pairs that don't, that are invisible. And so the reason for that is that if they did mix together, you would be able to extract one material into another one. And so in this case, we're going to use water here. Which I've dyed yellow so that we can see the difference clearly because water dyed more methane, which is the other solvent, look the same. So once you have your two solutions, you can pour each into the set funnel, and you want to make sure that this is closed so it doesn't pour right out. And when pouring your second solution in, you want to make sure you pour it gently so that it doesn't splash everywhere. So you'll see right away that they've started to form layers. And so what next we want to do is to cap this and start mixing. And when you do mix these two products, you create an amount of gas, so you want to vent this right away initially. And so you'll hear a hissing sound whenever you do vent it. And so you can shake it up a little bit, open up your end again, and you'll hear this hissing. And so we can mix this multiple times until the hissing actually stops. So when you let it rest for a little while, you can see the two layers form. And in this case, we've used dichloromethane and water. And so dichloromethane is actually heavier than water, so it'll be the bottom layer. But with a lot of different organic solvents, we'll see that layer on the top instead. And so before you start to pour, you want to make sure that your stopper is out so that it will actually come through. And then you can just open this up, and that bottom layer will pour right through. So you want to be careful that you don't get the water layer as well as the DCM layer. So once that gets pretty close, you can cut it off since you know what product you want is in the bottom. So we let the bottom layer run through the bottom, but when we're collecting the top layer, we want to be sure to pour it through the top of the set funnel instead.